Good morning, church. Thank you for having me. I pledge to Nigeria, my country, just as I pledge to Jesus, my Lord, to be faithful, loyal, and honest, and to obey his every word, saying those that are willing and obedient will eat the good of the land, not just in Ikorodu or Alaka, but also in Banana Island. But before I land, let's fly together. I want you to understand that no matter the exchange rate of the Naira, all things work together to all those who have unwavering faith in the Father. And if that's too much grammar, let me break it down. Bros, babe, oga, madam. I won't make you know say bad as the bad. Last, last, we go day all right, all right? So let's stop running. All these movements, all left, all right? But let's run together to God in one accord, not a under, but together in prayer and see how far God will take us. God will make a way. Divine insurance cover us. God now our cornerstone. God go lead way. So I want you to know that there is nothing that God cannot do. And if you want to fly to Canada or Norway, I pray the Lord will go before us and make every crooked way straight. Even where our blessings are, we will not be late. And if there's calamity on the way, the Lord will make us wait and give us the wisdom and the faith to know that he is never late. And those of us that want to be in this land, the Lord will bless us. Even in this same land, we will be great. When others are saying that there is a casting down, we will not be able to relate because it is God's word and it's not a matter for debate and we have his amazing grace amazing grace a wonderful attribute of God and though we've never seen his face we believe he is Lord a Lord so blameless who are we to stand in his presence if not for grace a Lord so ageless that eternity seems to be like a blink of an eye in his place his grace is so priceless that if we were to pay for grace our payments would have been long overdue Yet he sends the sun, the rain, the snow, the morning dew. You think you know, but you do not even have a clue of how much his grace has seen you.